ほう救いの者をよこすとは味なこと姉川で直隆を破ったのはお主かならば心置きなく夜叉となろう、うん This is one of the tougher bosses earlier on in the game. And it's a fight where you want to try and use heavier attacks that have less combos, less hits, that do more damage. Because if you do more than about two swings on him, usually he's going to pull up his like, feather shield and you'll bounce off. You'll take a lot of key damage and then he'll hit you with a really strong key attack、uh, that'll hurt like hell. So you don't want to try and attack very, very quickly with a fast setup. This one, it works really well to kind of go slow and just do like one, two hits. Periodically, he does this sort of jump attack where he lands on you and a little bit of an AoE. I've tried dodging this several times and it's not very reliable unless maybe you're going with a light build. If you're using something a bit heavier, it's just really easy to block. It takes almost no key damage, just block it and get a couple of hits in. Periodically, he does a Guardian Spirit attack where he summons water from the ground. These are very telegraphed, they have large areas and you can see them coming pretty quickly. You can just roll backward usually and get out of the way just fine. The main strategy for this fight is you want to bait him into doing combos that you can usually block or roll away from until he finishes an attack, or get him to do that vertical leap into the air and block it and get in some attacks. You're just going to try and want to bait him, just like most、uh, human encounters, bait them into doing some sort of combo, letting them finish, and then attack. Also, watch out for his grab attack because it hurts like hell. So, when he shifts into the Dark Realm, he's going to chuck some projectiles at you and then immediately charge you with a burst attack. Burst counter here is very, very iffy. I seem to be able to only pull it off about 50% of the time when I was trying it. So, if you don't feel confident, if something you've tried a couple of times and it's not working, you can try and just dodge through him, a timing, doing the timing a little bit differently in order to pass through him or dodge to the side. Later on, as you're fighting him in the Dark Realm, he's going to do something very similar to what he does when he first gets there. He's going to chuck some projectiles at you, but then he's going to try and grab you, so you need to dodge out of the way. And then immediately afterward, he's going to burst attack you very, very similarly to what he did in the beginning. It's again very hard to pull off a burst counter here, at least with the Feral Guardian that I'm using.、Uh, it's even harder than the initial one. So if you don't feel confident again, you can always just dodge out of the way and play it safe. It's worth trying to do a couple of times to see if you can get the timing down. It's just something I couldn't do reliably with this setup. So, more often than not, I just dodged out of the way. He does also just charge at you sometimes with a burst attack,、uh, which you see immediately after this. And those are a great opportunity to get a burst counter in. Very easy to pull off, stagger him, get some damage in. 